Hello again, John. Hello, Dutch. We gotta stop meeting like this. Sure. I got a plan, John. You always got a plan, Dutch. This is a good one. I don't doubt it. We can't always fight nature, John. We can't fight change. We can't fight gravity. We can't fight nothing. My whole life, all I ever did was fight. Then give up, Dutch. But I can't give up, neither. I can't fight my own nature. That's a paradox, John. You see? Then I have to shoot you. When I'm gone, they'll just find another monster. They have to. Because they have to justify their wages. That's their business. Our time has passed, yeah. So at the end, you didn't have the guts to shoot him. The man's dead, Ross. Sure. Can I see your gun? Hmm. Oh, trust me. It looks better in the report that way. Where's my family? Uh, your wife was killed in a prison riot last week. I'm only joking, dear boy. They were sent back to that Scrabble ranch of yours in Beecher's Hope. They're quite safe and sound. They better be. Thank you, Mr. Marston, for everything. I know this wasn't easy for you, but I have to say, you've done your country proud. Yeah, exactly. See you around, John. Try to stay out of trouble. Come on, Archer. Let's go find somebody else we can annoy. I'm sorry for your loss, ma'am. Take care. I really need to be alone if you don't mind. Could I have a little pride? Let's go! Slow it up now. Yeah. 
Abigail! Jack! Anyone here? Anyone home? Oh, darling. I never thought I'd see this day again. You no good hillbilly piece of shit! I thought you was dead! I thought you was dead, John, huh? Where you been? Where you been? You know where I've been, darling. You know. You saw Dutch, didn't you? Yeah, I saw him. And Bill? Yeah, I saw him too. And you didn't go back to him? I left that life. Just as you left yours. How'd they treat you? Oh, I can take care of myself, John. One guard got funny on me one time, but I wasn't so ladylike and he didn't try it again. Or no one else. How's the boy? Oh, like you. And like me. Well, he's like a kid growing up without a father. That ain't fair. What is fair? Well, some trees flourish, others die. Some cattle grow strong, others are taken by wolves. Some men are born rich enough and dumb enough to enjoy their lives. Ain't nothing fair, you know that. We tried to change. I mean, ain't that what you're supposed to do? We did change. And it's over now. Jack! Jack, come here, boy. Hello, sir. Come here. How you been? Coyotes ate all the chickens, and poachers took the cattle. I tried, Father. I tried. I know you did, son. I know. And don't you go blaming me, boy. Don't you go blaming me. I ain't blaming no one, old man, but since you're still alive, there's four mouths to feed and no cattle. That's a nice way to greet somebody. Why don't I get to warm and tender embrace? Consider the fact I ain't put a bullet in you, your embrace, old man. You were supposed to look after the place. I did. Well, I did my best. Thing is, there was too many of them. Uh, I thought you was dead. I wasn't drinking. Hold your excuses until you figured out which one to use. Jack, go get your bags packed, boy. We got work to do. We leave in the morning. Go on. Yes, sir. Where are you going? Well, it's getting kind of dark now, but in the morning we've got to go get ourselves some more cattle. I've got friends at McFarland's ranch. It's over in Hennigan's stead who can sell us some. Now, Abigail, I hope you learn to cook. Oh, yes, didn't I say? Rather than some prison, they actually kept me incarcerated in a cooking school for young ladies. 